my name is Melissa Chan and I'm the project manager of the Perhentian Turtle Project. So the Perhentian Turtle Project is based in the Perhentian Islands of Malaysia and specifically it's based in the village in the southeastern corner of the smaller island and it was officially set up in 2015. So the aim of PTP is basically to establish a baseline data of the sea turtle populations in the Perintian Islands. There is hardly any published papers or data about the sea turtles here. So when a volunteer arrives, first they go through orientation where we will introduce the project to them, the islands and what they'll be doing the next few days. And then depending on where they go, because our project is split into two bases. So if they're based in the village, then they'll first do kayak surveys, data analysis, beach cleanups, Malay dinners, snorkel tours, and even an awareness campaign at one of the local dive shops or resorts. If they're based at Tiga, they'll help us with light patrols, which means that they'll walk with us along the beach, up and down, and if we do see a nesting turtle, they'll help us record data. If the nesting turtle starts to lay eggs, then they'll even help us relocate the eggs as well. So helping us take the eggs from the nest, putting it into a bucket, and then bring it to the hatchery, and then putting it into a nest that we make ourselves to be stored there for 45 to 60 days. So for kayak surveys, what we do is we would kayak out from the village beach for 20 minutes towards a seagrass bay. So over there, that's where green sea turtles would feed. Once we arrived there, for an hour, we would swim in transects and looking for green sea turtles. So if you see a turtle, we would free dive down to take pictures of them. With that picture, we're able to tell who the turtle is and what the sex of the turtle is. So after the survey, we will come back and start IDing them against the database of other sea turtles that we've identified in the past. So with that database, we have approximately 303 turtles identified so far for both foraging and nesting turtles. And at the end of the year, all that data gets reported back to the marine parks and the fisheries in an annual report. So globally, sea turtles are endangered. Um, however, there are some populations that are rebounding. Unfortunately, not all populations are rebounding. There are still quite a few that are still decreasing in numbers. So one of the major threats to sea turtles is egg poaching, which is also a major threat here in the Perintian Islands. A few other threats include boat strikes, fishing entanglement, and even sea turtle hunting where people actually hunt sea turtles to consume their meat. So in addition to volunteers, we also cater to groups as well, so school groups and CSR programs. When they do come, what we do is we'll give them a brief turtle talk, so introducing the species of green turtles in Malaysia, our project, and what we do. I really hope you can join us in the Perintian Islands and help us make a difference in conserving the sea turtle populations here.